Hey guys, what is up? Saint Chivy here, and I'm doing a tutorial on how to install Pixelmon. I know I should have done this tutorial like at the start when I first did a video on Pixelmon, but I think I just been putting it off, or I just can't remember to do it. So um, there's a little problem with my internet right now, so that's why I couldn't really show you guys how to do it on the internet. But um, once you've downloaded it. Um, the link will be in the description um, for this and you will need Forge I'm assuming you probably already have it if you don't just search up um, Forge um, yeah I think you need 965 plus yeah something like that and I don't think I have Forge uh, but when you uh, if you wanna then you install Forge well that's not it Oh yeah, this is it. Yeah, what you want to do is install Forge. Um, this is not Forge, but after you installed Forge, um, it should create a folder called um, mods in your Minecraft. Let me just check what it, which one it is. Yeah, you need 9.11.1.65. Don't think that's the latest one, but that's the one it will run thing because I think it supports 3.5 and above or 3.8 and above but 6.5 is better so what you do is then just open your mods folder and just drag it in there um, I'm not going to because I already have it in there so I'm just going to go ahead and delete that and then what you could do is go ahead into your minecraft I have two I have the official launcher and the crack launcher but you know you can just go into it and then run it which I'll do right now okay so when it's load up let's go forge should say ready to play uh, but first time you probably launch it will say um, ready to update and play something like that other than that it should work wait for it to start up And yep, should be signing up. Um, and it should say like, um, if you only have Pixelmon, like I have five mods, but if you only have Pixelmon, it should say four mods loaded, because I'm I think Forge mod loader, uh, Forge mod loader, and Minecraft Forge. Now there's only two, so it'll be two mods loaded. Oh no, three. These three should be the ones already installed. And then your other two, so um, your other one, so that should be Pixelmon. But I have HD skins and Optifine. You can download Optifine, same as store method. And you can play it, but uh, it should up uh, all the stuff, but I'm not going to. And what else do you need? Installing it on the server. Um, you're gonna need to run that. Um, just see if I can show you like this. 365 Wait, why is there a mods folder here? Okay, doesn't matter Like some, I think, let me just check this Oh, so yeah, I have a custom mod pack on that, um Yeah, so, um, the MC Forge file, um, if you um, double click is installed to, install to client and install to server I can't really show you because I don't have the file but um, it should say install to client install to server and when you go install to server you have to change the um, property like change the folder it goes to install into and then install into like a folder where you keep all your servers like I have a Pixelmon server right here um, create a run dot bat file and I put three gigs onto it. You don't have to put this much. Um, you can do it in megabytes as well. If you want to put five twelve, you don't have a gig of RAM. Uh, let's just give. I'm just going to change it to one gig. 
that is a thousand twenty four megabytes if you're doing it megabytes wise um, you do Java then the how much RAM you wanted to have and you have to use XMS and XMX otherwise it doesn't work it doesn't virtualize the memory and forge uh, the name of the thing right here forge is I renamed it it was like really long before and I don't know if you need this but just put it in there yeah save that and then just run it and it should run up all these files it will run up the forge uh, mod files at the start that means I'm gonna have to open it up again oh wait I have to take the IP off it um uh, let me just take the IP off this um, yeah since I'm not online my IP probably shouldn't work and wait uh, yeah just run it again and I run I just play offline on my one yep and it see how many minutes using of the game which took all that stuff, but I haven't really loaded up all the way yet. Tell stuff, um, it's running in offline mode. I changed that, you can see it in the server probably. I'll that later, and now uh, how to make a server, like how to make a server tutorial or something. And, yeah, see it says done, finished in 6.85 seconds, type help. For help, type help, or question mark. And, well, you don't have to really, oh, damn it. It's happened sometimes. Um, there's also this console here. Use this console or this console. Doesn't really matter what you use. And just for this to load up. One thing I want to explain: if you want to join into the server you just created here, you're gonna have to use the mods um, you load it into the server as well. So if you wanted to run Pixel One, it'll create a file called mods and just put Pixel One in there and if I didn't have Pixel on this, I shouldn't be able to connect. Like, I should. Uh, I have a Bungie server. This is just run. This isn't. Wait, really? Fresh. Why is it connecting to that? It's not running through an IP there. Okay, that doesn't really matter. And it shouldn't be like if you use one gig, it shouldn't be enough for this. But you should use more than one gig. So like, this is the world. And this one I'm telling you is too laggy too much. But why is it just a random requaser? Is that meh? But whatever. And so let's just disconnect. And quick game. Okay. And let's open up this again. And I'll show you something else. If you want an in-depth tutorial on how to install a server, I will do that. But just not this one. So let's go. Just so it's running 1.7.4, right? Actually, no. I shouldn't run 1.7.4. I should be running 1.6.4. Um, let's go. Okay, so it's not running Forge. It's just 1.6.4. And then let's see if the multiplayer. Oh, come up right here. Okay. Yes. Okay, it's not. And it'll say, you don't have Forge mod loader installed, you can't connect to this. So let's say I go back, and let's just move this in there. Yes, whatever. And then let's say I run it with Forge mod loader. Install one. Pretty good. And. And let's check the mods. It says I'm running full mods. Oh, Pixel Mod's not running. Okay, so let's go back here. That is not the IP. That's not even an IP for anything. Um, these are just some other ones. I play Prison Tech. Um, I can't. I lag a bit too much on the server, so I can't record on that. Sky, sir. Sky server. I doesn't really. I don't really play on that too much, but I do go on that sometimes. So, if you guys are on that, find me. Um, 
So let's join the server. I'll say login. Oh, Forge mod loaded. Could not connect to the server. The mod um, and version listed below cannot be found. I request to play on the server, and you need Pixelmon 2.5.7. And how well, would you install that? Uh, also, Prison Tech um, Tiki is also released the Pixelmon server, which you can connect to as well. So you okay? And that's pretty much it for this. There's not really. Uh, hold on, I have 5.2 as well, but so the download link will be in the description. It will just be put the Pixelmon blog, and I just go ahead and stop this. Oh, wait, let me just click on the console. Stop is to it's that's the safe way to stop it. I say, but. I can give you an in-depth tutorial on that later, and I do have a main server. It's got Bungie and Bucket. Uh, it's a Bucket server. It's got, um uses Bungie, so three servers. I'm still working on it. Um, if you guys did see on the other video, but that time I wasn't running Bungie. I was running just one server. So there's a prison server. I got the works pretty well but I need to make it like a proper prison as you know I'll just show you my prison server right now it runs with 512 because of my bungee it doesn't lag when I play that much so I'm gonna have I'm gonna try having people join onto this and by the way to the channel it's gonna be a crack server so anybody can join because um yeah, because I don't want to just do be one of those servers that only people that have premium Minecraft can join. You know, I don't want to be that sad. What is this? Puzzle, blah, blah, blah. Gold IG and puzzle, blah, blah, blah. And we go latest. Because it's. Oh no. That should work. Multiplayer. Um, since I'm not on the internet right now, he will give me this. Oh, I just turn down this music. Eh, music and video, video settings. Just put the frame rate because I usually use put the mini map levels down. If your Minecraft goes black, um, like all the blocks go black, and then so it becomes like an inverted look, sorry, uh, sort of thing. This what is this one? Actually, no. I'm gonna pause this and I'll be back um, with it soon. I'm just gonna pause this. I don't see my can pause. So I have it loaded up. Over here, so you can see it says Minecraft server H here prison, whatever. You can go ahead and join that. It's not really see, I'm E right now, so let's just go spawn if I can type that right. So, this is how it goes. There's only about what so far, there's only f four wards with about five ranks, including three. So, there's C, E. I go C, B, A, and E. I'm sorry, it's lagging. I should put more. If I use Bucket, then it runs with more, but. If I use, sorry, if I use Bungie, it runs with more. But you can. Um, there's donations on this as well. I've set up the donations for this. Um, this could be a donate area. I'll make a donor area, I should say. And, yeah. I have to define the regions and stuff. And then that it runs pretty good, so yeah, that's what I really want to show you. Let's stop this. So I hope you guys did enjoy this tutorial and hope you guys um it helped you guys. If you need you know some more help then just uh write in the comments or private message me or something. And ask me to make a a follow up tutorial on this, and I promise I will be able to do a better job on that one.
if this one wasn't helpful enough.